Hey, what's up, guys? I am Miss Barry, and I am back today with another video. Looking at the title, you guys already know that this is a general love reading for the sign Pisces. You know, for my fellow Pisces, because I am a Pisces, February 22nd, 222. Oh, I just love it. Okay, anyway, guys. So, yeah, take it however it resonates. If it's not for you, please do not try to make it fit. It is not the piece to your puzzle. It is not for you, boo, okay? And for my cross watchers, feel free to switch the roles however you may like, however it applies to you and your situation. But again, this is a general reading for Pisces. All right, so I'm not going to do too much talking. But guys, be sure to check the description box down below where all my social media is listed. Follow me on social media on instagram on facebook and twitter i believe i have listed down below also guys i'm sorry i'm just really shuffling i'm not really starting yet but anyway so guys um also be sure to just check the description box at the end well and not really at the end but you know check the description box of every video just to make sure of any updates that i may post because i am going to post it in the description box below as well as you know i'll let you guys know in the videos too but just keep an eye out on the description box so be sure to check it every time i upload a video and also guys don't forget to like comment down below and hit that red subscribe button please and thank you because you guys don't want to miss any more videos that i have coming because i am posting daily back to back and I am also coming with new content as well, which I am getting that in the works now. So be sure to stay tuned for all the updates that I have coming, okay, guys? All right, so I didn't talk enough, so let's go ahead and see what's going on with my fellow Pisces and their person. What's going on with Pisces right now, please? Spirit, guys, excuse the siren in the background. I stay, I stay by everything. <laughs> Spirit, what's going on with my fellow Pisces, please, Spirit? Seven of Cups in reverse. So we have the Seven of Cups in reverse with the Sun card. I don't know why I heard, I don't want to be a player no more. I'm not a player. I should, you know that song by Big Pun, y'all? I ain't really that... I ain't that old. I ain't that young either. Oh, but I'm not that old. Okay. Not all of these. Just need one more card, please, Spirit. What's going on with Pisces, please, Spirit? And we have the Death card in reverse. Okay, let's see what's going on with Pisces person, please, Spirit. I'm going to take all of three. All three of them. they like, it's just too many. All right, what's going on with Pisces person? So we have the Ace of Cups. That's crazy because this just came out. I just seen this. <laughs> so we had the Ace of Cups. All right, what else is going on with Pisces person to the spirit? We have the Nine of Cups. Oops, that's too flash. <laughs> it's the way the angle of the camera and like where I'm sitting, it make it hard. Clarify what's going on with Pisces person to the spirit, one more card. And we have the Ace of Wands. All right, Pisces. I feel almost as if you you let go of a chase. Like you've made the decision to stop chasing something or this connection or this person. I feel like you came to the decision that you don't no longer want to just focus on this anymore like it's not really bringing you any good it's not really bringing you any good and it's crazy because it's like you're pulling out all of the emotion you have for this connection but at the same time you can't get away from it and here's your person down here with the ace of cups the nine of cups and this ace of wands here your person wants to offer you the ultimate love but i just feel like they don't necessarily know how to communicate their love like, I feel like your person 
don't really know. I'm not gonna say they don't really know because I'm pretty sure they do. I'm sorry, guys. Notifications going off, I'm sorry. But, um, okay, so yeah, I feel like your person has all of this love for you. They do genuinely care and everything. They, they really do, but I feel as if, I'm sorry, guys. I feel as if they just don't know how to properly display it. It's like they want to take action here with this Ace of Wands. They want to take action to actually come through. But they just like, they don't know. But I feel like they, once they get you back, Pisces, if they get you back, because I do feel like this is a connection with someone that you're not even communicating with right now. I do feel like, okay, once they get you back, Pisces, that they're going to hold on to your love. I feel like it could have been someone that could have taken your your heart for granted in the past. And it's crazy that I say that. And then this come out, Six of Cups. So somebody is definitely reminiscing. Somebody is definitely thinking back on the memories and the things that you guys have created together, shared together. They do miss you. And I feel like you do think about this person as well, Pisces. So you can't lie and say that you don't because I know that you do. I can see it. <laughs> Clarify the sun card, please, spirit. Okay, okay. Oh. I always got to go and fall. Like. So we have the six of pentacles, giving or receiving. I feel like Pisces, you just, you got tired of giving out energy that you wasn't getting back. I feel like maybe this person show is trying to come up and show their feelings a little too late. Like after you're coming to terms with, okay, maybe I just have to move on. Clarify the death card in reverse, please. Spirit. So we have the eight of wands, self-imposed, isolation, imprisonment. Yeah, I feel like you thought long and hard about it. And I feel almost as if you, Pisces, you just want to be done. Like, you're just at the point where you're like, I'm just done going in this round and round circle with you. So we have the Five of Swords, Happy Home, here for the Ace of Cups. So yeah, this person definitely wants this abundance with you. They definitely do want to build with you. They do see you in their future. They do want you in their future. Despite them probably not displaying that to you or expressing that to you they do clarify the nine of cups please clarify the nine of cups please oh now you want to be stubborn in a minute, I'm about to just start pulling. Spirit, please, can I just thank you? Thank you. Yeah, so we have the Ten of Cups, broken unhappiness. So, Pisces, whoever your person is, they miss you. They are definitely, definitely heartbroken about this connection because they felt as if you were the one. They felt as if, like, you know, you were different and this and that. Not to say that you aren't. But it could have been some things in the past that could have triggered this person. Maybe they could have had um, past experiences that could have traumatized them. Um, we have the Page of Pentacles, Desire to Learn, Persistent Money News. But yeah, I feel like this person is willing to learn how to express themselves. Learn how to communicate this emotion that they feel for you. Like, be more open for you. I feel like you're changing this person, not necessarily because they don't want to, but I feel like they're trying to change for the better for you. For you, Pisces, excuse me. I definitely feel like, yeah, they're trying to change for the better for you, Pisces. And um, they're willing. I feel like in the past, maybe they weren't willing to. Maybe they wasn't willing to be open. Maybe they wasn't as open 
with their emotions as you would have liked them to be. Or shoot, hell, Pisces, maybe you wasn't as open as you like yourself to be. I feel like sometimes you could have thrown your person for a loop. Maybe you could have thrown your person for a loop. So we have the three of wands, the vision in the future, teamwork, which goes hand in hand with this. I, can't, I don't know if I'm saying this right, but nostalgia, if I'm saying it right, which is pretty much the same thing, reminiscing. So yeah, Pisces, you have thought about a future with this person. You have thought about what life will be like. I'm pretty sure you've had made a whole fairy tale scene in your head. I'm pretty sure you have because we all have been there and done that. Mm. So we have the Ten of Swords fighting the battle. So yeah, I feel like, and we have the Nine of Pentacles, mistakes, bad failure. So yeah, Pisces, I feel like you fought to get to where you are. I feel like it's been a lot of, like I say, back and forth, a lot of unsureness. It's just been a lot of uncertainty. It's been a lot of confusion. Like, you guys have all of this emotion for each other, but what? And we have the Seven of Cups, procrastination. So, yeah, I feel like your person definitely procrastinated when it came to their feelings and it came to speaking the truth on how they really felt. I felt like they held back. And when they got to the point where it's like, okay, I feel like I can tell you, I feel like I can tell you, or whatever the case may be, they don't tell you. Like they don't, they didn't build up enough courage to tell you. Maybe they don't know how you're going to react or maybe they don't think you feel the same. Maybe they're afraid of getting their heart broken. You know what I'm saying, Pisces? We have the three of cups, friendship building. Yeah, so I feel like your person definitely wants this abundance with you. We have the ace of wands mistake. Exactly. So like I said, I feel like your person feels as if they made a mistake to walk away from you excuse my squeaky chair y'all y'all know the squeaky chair story my son you know it's crazy but anyway so yeah <clears throat> your person could probably regret walking away from you maybe they walked away from the situation pisces or maybe you walked away from this person and they're heartbroken from it either way it go you guys are definitely not in communication really right now at all and i feel like your person kind of regrets how they acted in the past All these cards come out. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh. I'm sorry, guys. I'm trying to get it together. Get it together. Look, three cards, and I only needed three. That's what I'm talking about, spirit. Just lay it on out there. Lay, lay it on out there. So we have the happy, happy card. Okay. We have the clean it up card. And we also have the TikTok card. So yeah, your person knows that they messed up, Pisces. Your person knows that they messed up. They knows that they could have taken your love for granted. But guess what? They only want this happiness with you, Pisces. They're working on a way, trying to figure out how to clean up the mess that they made. They know that you're in a direction like you're walking away from this connection. They know that they're losing you. And they know that they only have a certain amount of time like they know that the time is ticking for them to try to make this right soulmate this is a soulmate connection yes for for anybody that was like just unsure if it was if it was not this is a soulmate connection it says release your ex the time has come to clear your energy i feel like this card before before y'all say some let me go ahead and explain i feel like this card pretty much is for more so your person and not you uh pisces or it could be for you you could be you know but what i think this means is your person needs to release what your what their ex did to them in the prior relationship that made them feel like oh i can't trust this female i can't trust that female like they can't really trust you the way that they want to because they're still stuck in the past of what this ex did to them so it's hard for them to really move forward with their emotions from you because they're still stuck in the past with the emotions of how they felt then. It could have been, it could have happened like 10 years ago, but guess what? Oh, okay. 
It could have happened 10 years ago, but guess what? It still, it still bothers your person. Like whatever this ex person did to them, it really scarred them. It really did. It really scarred them and it made them, it affected the, uh, their other relationships from that point on. Dang, okay. And it's funny that I said that because what this say? Healing family issues. That's exactly what that says. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. It's, but pretty much, I just feel like your person, Pisces, has some healing, self-healing to do. Because in order for them to offer you the love that you desire and the love that you want, there is definitely some healing within themselves that they have to do. Because they have to let go of that past. They have to let go of that relationship that served them no purpose. Pisces and now it could be you it could be you you could be the one that's not really displaying that much love to this person or be the one that's holding this connection back it could be you oh I'm gonna take both of them crazy crazy thank you spirit spirit just loves clarifying so we have the answers you need are coming full moon in Gemini you know full moon what did I say it's a lot of forgiveness. It's a lot of results coming. It's a lot of results coming your way. Pisces, you just have to learn to be patient. And then we have work through your fears. New moon and Scorpio. So we also have new moon. So there's a clean slate coming. All you got to do. I feel also this is more so for your person though. Pisces, like work through your fears. I feel like your, your person has the fear of loving you. I feel like they feel like if they love you, if they accept you if they love you i feel almost as if they feel like it's going to jeopardize their life it's going to mess up their life or something or things is not going to be the same things are going to turn out the way it used to no that's not the case pisces it's not the case it's not the case at all so take it however it resonates guys that's pretty much all i have for you today like i said be sure to check the description box down below also like comment and subscribe and stay tuned for more videos that i have coming. All right, till next time, guys.